Welcome to Low Country Harley Davidson. I'm Doc Harley. Well, this customizing your motorcycle is really getting to be strong. A lot of you are making big lists and still got the itch. You want to do something, something that'll get you through till you get the big items. Well, they come to me and say, well, what can I do, Doc, just to get through? Here's a small idea and you got to stay with me because it sounds silly, but it's not really. What about your valve cap? All right, yes, you, you get it from the factory and, and you hardly notice it. It's black and but hey, a valve cap is a small investment and it works two ways. Here's the idea. If you spend the money for a valve cap, I bet every time you walk out to your motorcycle, you're going to look for them. <laughs> Caught your eye? Okay. Every time you walk out to your motorcycle, you're going to see your valve cap and go, hmm, nice, looks good. You're also going to be wondering, hmm, I wonder what my tire pressure is. That's the added plus of customizing your motorcycle. You've chosen your valve caps and you're looking at them and you go, hmm, I wonder what my pressure is in my tires. And if you're wondering, then maybe you'll come by Low Country Harley Davidson and have it checked out because keeping your tires up to pressure to the factory spec helps your tires last longer. So you've customized your motorcycle and also helped your motorcycle last longer. So it's not a bad idea. Think about it. Now, some of you are going to run out to uh, an automotive place and get some different valve caps. Here's the caution in buying valve caps, all right? The factory valve cap is round. There's a reason, because underneath, of course, is the little plunger that allows air in and out. When you buy customized valve caps, a lot of them are flat, all right? And they were made for a different type, automotive type valve cap. So you squeeze it on down and it pushes a little bit on that valve and you start losing a little, maybe one PSI a week and your tires start getting a little bit slower, okay? So when you're buying valve caps, look for maybe possibly round. The other thing is on valve caps, a lot of the custom ones have an O-ring in it because they've made them flat and they don't want it to come down. So they put the little rubber O-ring in it so it goes down and it stops. Great idea. But what happens if that uh, O-ring gets a little shrinkage and starts starting to fall out? Well, here's what happens, okay? The O-ring, instead of laying this way, is up and down. Now, yeah, it's hard for you to see this, but a lot of them have this O-ring. And when it goes this direction and you're not looking what you're doing and you put it in, well, yeah, that's what happens. The O-ring starts pushing on the plunger and you start losing a little PSI. So. Yes, it's not a big rocket science putting valve caps on your tires, but there's something to look for. And it's also something to look for when you're buying other than the Harley Davidson product because they're designed for the valves that come in your tires. So you're looking for a small little idea to help you get to the big customizing job that you're working towards. How about a valve cap, huh? It'll keep your mind thinking, hey, what's the tire pressure? And hey, that does look kind of good every time I walk out to the garage. Just a little idea from Doc Harley and Low Country Harley Davidson.